I hope that you are not sick of pin mail because wow, this is the largest pin mail haul we have ever had in a single day. And yes, this is all from the mail today. This enormous pin mail day is likely the result of having some extra time off around the holidays and being able to pop into more whatnot shows than normal. We have another package from a Vader pin trader. You heard me talk about him a lot in my last video. Love him as a whatnot seller. He is fantastic. Cannot recommend him enough. If you have any interest in Disney pins, whatnot, Vader pin trader, check him out for sure. Oh my goodness. I just made a little squeaky noise because I got one of his pin pluckers. Oh, here's a little something for your amazing support. Thanks, Carlos and Jess. Oh my goodness. I am so excited to see this. He 3D prints these himself and he sells them. And I had been thinking I really needed to scoop one up. And then when I just dumped out this package, this one came out. Oh my goodness, that is so kind. So the idea behind the pin plucker is that when you are trying to get a pin off of a board, you can use the plucker to come behind the pin and then gently pull it up so that you are not bending the post. I am so excited about that. That was very kind of him to include this in my order. Wow, really nice quality on these too. Love that it has his name on it. He sells a miniature version and I like the miniature version and I'll probably pick one up, but I really didn't want to grab a miniature one because I wanted the one that said Vader Pin Trader on it. Love that, oh my goodness. Cannot wait to pop into another one of his shows and get to thank him for that. And actually he has a show tonight. So we'll be able to do that. We also got some more candy. He sends little bits of candy in his packages or he has thus far anyway, which is very kind of him as well. My kids will enjoy it for sure. So thankful for some candy. We have very nicely wrapped pins here. Love how he wraps his pins. Love the cards that they come on. Love his personality in his show and his genuine desire to make sure that his buyers are happy with their purchases and uh, that he is selling quality items. So I really just can't say enough great things about Vader and his wife and their shows on whatnot. So there's that. Really check them out. We have this adorable pin that says 75 years with Mickey. Look at that cute little pin. We have another kite in our kite series. This is the Peter Pan kite. This series is almost complete for me now. I just need a stitch. I have Duchess from the Munchling series. She is a bit of a harder one to find. Some people say it's Marie. Some people say it's Duchess. So I guess it's just whichever you feel it is. She is either from series two or three. I can't remember at the exact moment because she has that little crystal on the back. I have unfortunately heard that these have already been faked. I hope that that's not true, but it likely is. The crystals, I mean, not the munchlings. But series two and three all had the little crystals on them. So there is Duchess. Again, so nicely wrapped. Taking the tape off so I can reuse these in the future when I send out some pins. I love this little one. This is such a cute little pin. It's shaped like a Mickey head and it looks like a little bell. Very, very cute. I was able to collect almost this entire skydiving set from Vader during this show that I popped into. It's a hidden Mickey set. Here is Mickey himself all suited up in his skydiver gear. And I was also able to get Minnie Mouse from this set. She is a cutie as well. Getting into the next little bundle. Oh, I had forgotten that I grabbed this little Donald present from this set. Very cute little Donald present. This Simba is so cute. He's just a very classic looking Simba and I appreciate that. 
I like a good classic Simba. He has two pin backs. He is the Disney 100 Simba. So cute. And we have this little stitch head. Look at his little teeth. And then we have the goofy cupcake to add to our cupcake set. And then we're back to that little stitch. Oh my gosh. He is a cutie. Look at the little teeth. <laughs> I'm falling more and more in love with Stitch. I've always liked him, but since pin collecting, there are a lot of Stitch pins and he's just real cute. Let's get these onto the board. I do still have more from Vader, but let's get these ones up. On to the next package from Vader. Oh my goodness. So much wonderful pin mail, and this is only our first package. I should have saved Vader's package because I know I love my things from him, but I was too excited. Here's Goofy from the skydiving set. And here's Donald from that skydiving set. And then look at this little Dale. No, Chip. Chip. Chocolate Chip. Dark nose like a chocolate chip. Look at Chip with that little tooth. Oh my gosh. He's a cutie. Last bundle of pins from Vader for this portion of the pin mail video. These three are from the Tattoo series. These are lounge fly pins and they're very cute. I like the florals with them. There's Daisy. So at this point I now have half of this series. Here is Pluto. And last that I have so far in this series, here is Mickey. Too stinking cute. Interesting that Daisy and Pluto both have the lounge fly markings, but Mickey doesn't. I wonder why. And believe it or not, that was only package one. Here we are on to the next package. This has fewer pins in it, so it will go a little faster. We've got some stickers. We have a grumpy Donald and Pocahontas. Very sweet little additions there. <gasps> this is completing my set of these princesses. Thank goodness she is here. This is the pink a la mode exclusive of Belle. I have every other princess in this set. Belle was the last one that I needed and she was a hard one to find. And I finally scooped her up at a pretty good price and she is here. She looks great. I'm gonna leave her in the package for now because she's a hard one to find and I want her to be protected. On to the next package making sure that this is everything in there. Oh, we have Dopey in the hot air balloon. Here is Dopey. He is coming home to join my hot air balloon set. I don't think I've completed this set quite yet. I think I'm missing two in this series at this point, but here is Dopey. So cute. <gasps> That's all of the dwarves lined up on the hot air balloon. I didn't notice that until now when I have it in person. That is very cute. I was able to get one more of the hot air balloons from the same seller. And this one is Simba. Look at that beautiful Simba up here as well as the more classic Simba down here. Well, I guess that's classic too, but that's Rafiki's drawing of Simba. So there is Simba. What a beautiful balloon. That detailing up there is nice. And here's what the back of that one looks like. So very fun to be adding these two hot air balloons to our hot air balloon set. Getting close to completing this one. On to the teal package. This one feels heavy. Not exactly sure what's in this one to make it feel so heavy. Okay. That is everything. There's our packing slip. 
Ooh, ooh, yes, I was excited and waiting for that one to come. This is from a whatnot seller who runs a very interesting show. This is one of the brand new 2024 pins. It is a very beautiful pin. I'm ultimately going to leave it on this card back, which I think is very cute, but I'll take it off at the moment. Look at the glitz in the 2024. Minnie and Mickey are so cute. The colors are very vibrant and it says the most magical place on earth. There's the back. You can tell it's a newer pin because it has that little crystal on it. Back onto its card back so we can keep it protected. Very cute pin. Happy to be adding this one to my collection as well. Next up, adding to the kite collection, we have traditional Mickey. I am then adding to my music note collection. This is a bird. I forget his name and what movie he's from. I just know he's part of the collection. Newer series, he's got the little crystal on him as well, but there he is. Another music note in that collection, we have a Mickey Mouse. Last pin in this package, we have Sleeping Simba. He goes with the Dreaming or um, Sweet Dreams, I think it's called, series, which I do have complete at this point. They just have not all arrived home. I just finished it in a show yesterday. I got the last four that I needed, so those will be coming sometime soon. On to this little blue package now. Oh, that's a cute bag that everything came in. We've got our packing slip. Look at this cute little Disney bag. I love that, Beauty and the Beast. Very nicely packaged. This is from a whatnot seller called Double JJ31. I really have enjoyed this seller. I actually just purchased from them yesterday as well. And now that I'm seeing how nicely they've packaged things, oh, the Care Bears pin, I'm that much more excited to have made some purchases from them. Oh, yay, two more of our kites. We are making some good progress on the kites. We have Sorcerer Mickey here and Dumbo. So here is Sorcerer Mickey. Here is Dumbo. And then we got this little Care Bears pin. This was, uh, was it a giveaway or did I buy this one? <laughs> I can't remember now. This was a giveaway. Yes, this Care Bears pin was a giveaway and it is mighty cute. It is a lounge fly pin. I think that I will, mm, I don't know, that rainbow is beautiful. Probably gonna keep it on its card back, but I'll take it off for the moment so that we can really get a good look at it. Look at the glitter in there. Which Care Bear is this? I can't remember, and I don't think the card back says. Well, I don't remember which Care Bear it is. He's got a heart on his belly. He's cute. All right, we're making progress. Moving along to this package now. Woo, look at that pile of pins. In here, we have Santa Mickey. We have a food truck. I am excited. All right, so we have Santa Mickey. We have Santa Minnie. Very cute little pair. And we have a Pluto food truck. Santa Mickey is from this Christmas, so he has the little crystal there. He's balancing a present on his finger. Minnie has a sack of presents. Very cute little shoes. She also has the crystal on her backside, and they both are double prongs. And then we have our Pluto food truck. That's a cute one. I wasn't going to collect the food truck series, but I've scooped them up on good deals so far, so we're going for it now. Next little bundle here. Oh, we've got another Mickey Emotion. We've got Zazu, and I think another food truck. We have the Dumbo food truck. Look, he's selling peanuts. Is that not the cutest? And if you didn't see, Pluto was selling dog bones. 
Here's another Mickey Mouse emotion. This set is now complete as well. I just purchased the last one yesterday, so it hasn't come yet, but it is a complete set at this point. And Zazu is part of a two pin set. Scar also came with him. I did not get Scar, but I was able to grab Zazu, who's sad in the bone cage. We are rapidly running out of room on the board, so we shall see if we have enough room for everyone before this video concludes. <gasps> I'm excited about this one, My Happy Places with You. This is one that I've been eyeing for a little while. It's a newer pin, and it is just adorable. I love the little gems at the center of the fireworks, the way their tails come together and form a little heart, and they're holding hands. Very precious. And one more Mickey emotion. We are down to four packages. Minnie Mouse hot air balloon. And she's even on her backer card. I'm gonna leave her right there on her backer card. She's a little crooked on it, but I'll probably take her off to add her to my pin book and then just keep the backer card. But there she is. Next up, we have this little black package. Oh, I feel a lot of stuff in here. Oh, yep, a lot of, a lot of, wow, I think I have a lot of stickers in there. This is Figment from several videos ago who didn't make it into my purchase, but here he is now. She shipped him to me at no extra cost since he got accidentally left out. And wow, did she go above and beyond and add in some extras. She also sent this Hocus Pocus pin as a freebie. That was very, very kind. That's a lounge fly pin. And then look at all these extras. We have got Lindsay Lohan from, um, not Freaky Friday, but what's the other one? She's at Mean Girls. And then look at all of these cute stickers. Kindness is so gangster. You can sit with us. Oh, the limit does not exist. I like that one. My math teacher heart loves that. Oh, a cute pink phone. Oh my goodness. How very sweet. An extra pin, all these stickers, and the only thing she really needed to send me was just fear right here. That was so kind. I unfortunately do not have her whatnot name. Her first name is Amber though, and amazing seller. So I will be sure to shout her out with her whatnot name when I locate it. Ooh, this is another purchase from Picking Porter. You guys know I really like Picking Porter. She is another fantastic seller on whatnot. Definitely support her and appreciate her streams as well as the way that she clearly beautifully packages her materials and sends things off with care. And in here we have some of the animals sitting in chairs pins. We have Copper from Copper and Todd, Fox and the Hound. These animals sitting in chairs are a whole lounge fly set that I am working on. And oh, the cute. They are cute. Here we have a Cheshire cat lounging with a teapot. And oh my goodness, do you see in the corner the little mouse is poking his face out of the teapot? Oh gosh. And then we have a couple from the Raincoat Animal set. This is another series that I'm working on. And I think I'm close to, close to completing at this point. This is one that I can't remember the name of or even what movie she's from right now. These pets and raincoats are very thick and they feel like a really nice quality. So these are the three that we have. This is Dinah, I know that. This is Figaro and I just don't know this dog. This is what they look like on the back. And then these are our two pets in chairs and they have very different backs, which is neat that they're in the same set, but have different colored backs. That doesn't always happen. 
We are down to our final package and we are essentially out of room. So it's a good thing that this is it. Oh, this one has stickers and a sweet note. I just am telling you, there are some really kind sellers out there. This one says, Happy New Year, Brittany. We wish you all the best. May your goals and dreams come true. Thank you for your purchase, Ruthie and Claire. We are on the lookout for Minnie. Oh, I missed one in their show that I really needed. Someone snatched it from me. So that's so sweet that they're on the lookout for me, for Minnie. So kind. So this is a whatnot seller called Pins Collecting, and they are very kind. They are another group of ladies, another seller. Those are very cute little castle stickers that I would definitely recommend. They just have great items and really, again, do care about those that are purchasing from them. Oh, yay. Another one in this set. I believe that they helped me complete this set on this night that I was involved in their show. So I'm very excited about that. I have these different colored hidden Mickey heads that are all part of a set. So we have the light blue one home. We have this orangey red one here. It's hard to tell because there's this orangey red one and then there's also a pink one in the set and it's kind of hard to tell which is which, but I'm pretty sure I got the right one. If I didn't, it's not on them, it's on me, but I'm pretty sure this is the right one. And then here we got another, oh my gosh, he's too cute. We got another one of these traveling the world. That's not what they're called, but something like that. Um, portrait pins and this is the mini that they're talking about she's the only one that I need in this set now and they had her I asked about it and somebody outbid me and snatched her up from under me which it is what it is it is a bidding format so it is fair but typically people are respectful when they know that someone else is after an item and it was clear that I was after this one because I had specifically asked about it. And if I hadn't asked about it, it wouldn't have even ended up in the show and been up for bid. So that did feel a little bit frustrating. And then we also have this hidden Mickey who is giving Hawaii vibes. He's got this lay around his neck with those very cute flowers. And he concludes the pins that we are opening today. And there you have today's pin mail haul. What a haul. Look at all those pins in a single day. I am very fortunate that I was able to collect these pins as usual, adding to some sets, starting some sets, and completing some sets. We got some freebies, some bonuses. I'm so appreciative to the sellers that I have purchased from on Whatnot and am very thankful that I can shout them out and turn others on to them because they deserve it. They run great shows and they are very kind people. So happy to help them in that little way that I can. And I want to show you real quick how the pin plucker works so that if you are ever able to hop into one of Vader's shows and you would like one of these, you could grab one for yourself. So this end just goes underneath the pin and the pin back goes right there in between that little groove. So you can go stick it right behind your pin like this and just gently pop it off and it just saves your fingernails as well as the pin so that you're not causing it any damage. Works on large pins, they just pop right off. Works on small pins, works pretty great. I am very thankful to have one. I'm not even really having to get that part onto the pin or I did on some of them, I did on that one, but there you go. There's an example of how it just helps to pop those pins off. The board is so heavy, it keeps sliding down, but very great tool, works really well. Thank you so much to Vader Pin Trader for including this in my purchase. He has no idea that I'm even shouting him out on this channel. None of the whatnot sellers do. It is just my genuine, authentic opinion. Here is the complete collection of these little colored Mickey faces. And I was right that this was the orange one. I was concerned that it could have been this pink one because on camera, these two uh, look a lot alike. So thankful that it was not a duplicate and I do indeed have the full set now. Here are the six kites that I have home. It is an eight kite collection. The Dalmatian kite is coming in the mail to me as we speak and I have yet to track down the stitch one.
this is a beautiful sight. All of the Disney 100 princesses are together. This is the complete set of five. Belle is the last one that we just added in today. She did have a bent pin back, but I was able to actually use Vader's um, pin plucker and this end of it to gently reposition the prong. You can see a little bit of marking that I got on it, but I feel like that's a great use for this end because it is a plastic that's, it's not soft per se, but I just felt like it was the best tool to try to get that pin back, back into shape. So she's good to go now. There she is with her other princess friends, and that is a complete set. The Duchess Marie Sunday has joined the Series 3 Munchling Collection. And there are the rest of the Munchlings. Series 1 is the first three rows on top. Series 2 is the next three rows. And then Series 3 has only two rows right now, but I have quite a few in the mail. So they will either fit there or need to go on another page. On this page, we have added in the Goofy Cupcake. Fear has joined Anger and Sadness. The emotions have come together. One more, at least one more to come in the mail. Those look really nice together. And then here are the hot air balloons that we have so far. We added a bunch to the random board. My random boards end up being my favorite because I just love the assortment. We added Simba on this board to the Sweet Dream series. On this page, we added the music notes and Goofy from the portrait set. And then we started a page here I moved these balloons from elsewhere. I didn't actually get any of them today. I'm missing just one. And then I moved the skydivers to this page. We put our tattoo series, our animals in raincoat series, started our food trucks, our animals in chairs, and this stitch one I didn't get today, but I have quite a few more from this series coming, so I knew he was gonna need some more space too. That's gonna be it for today's haul. Thank you so much for joining me. Can't wait to see you in the next one. Bye.